All right, good afternoon. It's a little bit loud in here, but I just want to do a little video of uh, a day in my life, you know, because right now it's the only day we got, right? And I just hope everybody's having as great of a day as I am today. just wanted to talk about it a little bit about my day and what I do, and got the Guardians on here. Looks like they're going to hopefully sweep the series, so just hanging out watching the ball game. It's in the afternoon. Baseball's relaxing. And, uh, yeah, it's about six o'clock. This is my room. Got a lady out there in the hall. Got my roommate here, Tommy. He's hanging out watching some USFL. So, you know, put that uh, TV on mute. Tommy's is on, but we'll get a little background noise. But just uh, what a great day! It's uh, Holy Saturday. Easter's tomorrow, and. Um, Actually had a great, uh, great night's sleep last night for the first time in several weeks. Um, so I woke up rested. They put me through some physical rehab here, working on the walking. And uh, maybe get this. You see, I'm a fall risk. <laughs> so we'll work on that. But um, so I did some rehab early. Woke up this morning after a nice, peaceful night's sleep. Um, and I uh, had some good breakfast, and uh, then my sister came to see me. She came back from San Diego. It was nice to see her. And uh, my friend Bob, Bob B came, and uh, he was here with her. And then um, we went out to uh, Little Italy and had a great uh, pizza over at Mama Sana's and uh, had a cigar with the Mayfield Smoke Lodge. It was nice. Of course, Carolyn didn't go there, but... All right, and then I uh, had a couple buddies come up. Then Bob Bob P came up. Had a great time. Bob drove me back. He's been a great trooper. And uh, then Jack came out. Jack came out to the cigar shop. And then I met some of these other guys. One guy's uh, studying to be a uh, oncologist at the cigar shop. He's in school, and I was telling him a little bit about my journey. Shared my YouTube videos. Thought he might get something. I gave him a charge to. Keep doing the work, you know, find find some uh, cures and I gave him some tips about what I'm going through and he can watch my videos. That was cool. And then some other friends I met at Cigar Lodge there at uh, Mayfield to some great people, Michelle and uh, Nick and some of the other, uh, some of the other guys, and, uh, a couple of guys in the program and just really cool. So um, had a great time there. And uh, gosh, what else? We, uh, Bob and I had a good talk, and I came back, and um, just going to relax a little bit here. Hopefully the Indians will take this, uh, the Guardians will take this series. And I'm just appreciative of another day. You know, when I wake up, I thank God for, uh, I'm still alive. Still got my, uh, my brain functioning and uh, cognition. Hope that continues, because it's just been so wonderful, you know, that uh, hopefully the, uh, Radiation works. And we, uh, we keep cognition going, but uh, we'll do it God's time, you know. And then, yeah, you know, listen to the prayers. You know, the prayers you go app. I did that. What a wonderful time to listen to it during Holy Week. Uh, it was very uh, inspirational. And uh, I think I'm driving my nurses crazy because I'm a little more active than their average patients. So uh, I got in. I actually shaved, so that was nice. I got a British nurse. And then we were talking about the whatever Britain has given us a lot, a lot bad habits probably. But uh, I was telling her, you know, music, you know, appreciate the Brits for that. And then uh, I was educating her a little bit on the shaving soap. So I said, you know, Britain's got the uh, great shaving soaps, Truford and Hill. So I was able to shave up, get a shower. It was a blessing, and uh, just kind of relax, you know, and. and uh, just enjoy this day. I did some uh, physical rehab. They have a great rehab facility here. Um, physical rehab at the skilled nursing center here. And, and um, so I got a lot of exercises in, kind of working on that awareness, balance issues. That was great. Kind of wore me out a little bit, but that's okay. I'll sleep better. And um, so what else? And Bob and I drove back. He's listening to my Spotify playlist. And uh, that was cool. So we shared some good music. Um, 
you know, and then uh, talked to Lisa, and Lisa got the car back, it's got the ceramic coat on it and all that, I'm happy with that. She picked up her ring, so she's got that, she sent me a picture of that, it looks good. Wishing her dad well, he's uh, got to go undergo a surgery for a kidney stone, which sounds quite painful, so hope you'll uh, get through that okay. And then uh, tomorrow's Easter, so I'm looking forward to, I think I'll, Lisa will come up, hopefully I'll get to go home for a little bit during Sunday, and then over to my sister, she's going to have Easter dinner, Jessica's picking up the honey baked ham and turkey, so it'll be a great day tomorrow, um, and I'll uh, just uh, plug away and look forward to seeing my dogs, and, and uh, getting home for just a few hours, I'm going to be back here by at least by midnight, I guess, insurance-wise, but, um, you know, just looking forward to that, and, uh, some of my new friends here, will go outside later and have a cigar, even though I already had one, but, but uh, a little, little later, we'll sit out there, and my sister help organize my clothes, and, uh, one nurse came in and said, got too much clutter in here, so we cleared out some of the clutter, which is good, So a lot of stuff, a lot of stuff going on. Uh, I got to see Jack. Jack came out to the cigar shop too. I'm going to mention that. And um, yeah, so overall, what great conversations there. I mean, cigars are just a fantastic way to kind of relax and enjoy people. And I've been doing that. Got a nice card from Rachel. Um, good text messages and uh, to catch up on things and. Uh, so, what a great day. I hope, you know, everything I'm going through, I mean, don't feel sorry for me because I'm actually having the time of my life in many ways. Obviously concerned about this tumor growing and hopefully it'll stop, but, but each day is a blessing, right? So I hope you all out there live your life like it's a blessing each day, you know, just try to enjoy life, see God's beauty, talk to people, connect to people, and, um, yeah, so... So life is like life is precious, you know. And if my brain for I mean, it's such a wonderful brain keeping in there with me and connecting and and uh, gosh, what else? I don't know. It seems like a lot of things I was thinking about, but I uh, just want to do a little check-in and uh, tell you everything's going well. And um, looking forward to the rest of the night, resting up and. Um, seeing what uh, tomorrow has in store so again thanks to the uh, followers I appreciate all your comments they inspire me thanks for letting me do this it keeps me uh, feeling like I'm giving back and, um, so and I'll, I'll do a little video maybe later on you know nursing home and, and sort of the you know some of the things that I would suggest they focus on you know dignity of the person autonomy respect, you know, those type of things. It's so important for everybody in here to have that. And um, sometimes they get lost and, you know, jobs can be tough. And, you know, but, uh, you know, it's really go into this work, you know, medical field, nursing field, whatever it may be, you know, just keep those things in mind. The dignity of the person, respect for the person, their autonomy. And, uh, you know, it, it can be really, we can do that in any part of our job, right? And uh, keep that in mind. It, it really helps respect the person and uh, so hopefully I've done that today showed them some kindness and care and we'll continue on so um, that's all I have for now so have a great day and we'll see you soon